Hello and welcome to the Middle School Bookmarker Super Quick Book Preview Show. This episode, we're checking out Shot Clock by Karan Butler and Justin A. Reynolds. Let's give it a preview to see if you want to read it. Boom, boom, boom. I pop up in bed like, where's the fire? Evacuate the building. It takes me a 10 count to realize it's only Monka banging down my door like a wannabe firefighter. Yo, chill. I yawn, decrust my eyes. Thing about my sister, Monka's 100% chill less. She stays at a 10 bossing me and Tasha like she's paying us a salary. FYI, she definitely isn't. At least three or four times a week, I gotta check her, remind her she's barely two years older than me. Boom, boom, boom. Man, she for real right now? Quit it, what do you want? Less attitude for one, Monka snaps. You're late, big head. I'm about to fire back. When my brain finally catches up with my eyes, I read the alarm clock and, oh snap, she's right. I explode out of bed, grab my gear, and crash into the bathroom. And now let's take a look at the back of the book blurb. Tony loves basketball, but the game changed recently when his best friend Dante, a hoops phenom, was killed by a police officer. Tony hopes he can carry on Dante's legacy by making the Sabres, the AAU basketball team Dante took to two national championships. Tony doesn't make the team, but Coach James likes what he sees from Tony at tryouts and offers him another chance. Join the team as the statistician. With his community reeling and the team just finding its footing on the court, can Tony find a path to healing while helping bring the Sabres a championship? All right, let's wrap this baby up. Moment of truth, is this book for you? If not, be sure to check out some of the other books we have on the Super Quick Book Preview playlist. If you like poetry books, you might like Brown Girl Dreaming. Or if you like books about zombies and monsters, you might like The Last Kids on Earth. Thank you so much for checking out this book with me. Be sure to hit like and subscribe, and I hope you find something that you want to read.